which is what we are actually seeing. So that is that is. Good afternoon. Um, welcome to you all. We spoke to you two years back. Uh, you know when we were taking uh, baby steps in this space. Uh, when we first got our uh, when we got our series B funding. Um, I am very happy to once again talk to you all after the two years span with another major milestone that we are talking about, the launch of a, a product platform. Um, that time we had uh, one product that we were selling and we got uh, a series global sales and customer support. Uh, Bala joined us from uh, GE Medical Systems, very next to Bala. Don is from the United States. Uh, he currently lives uh, in Bangkok. He is a the region director for Asia Pacific region. We get into the product or the uh, technology, what we are talking. I uh, just want to know, I mean, just want to briefly uh, uh, talk about the space we are in and uh, why we are in. If you see the uh, uh, news item from uh, the uh, 2006 RSN, which talks about uh, the image guided uh, therapy as the new uh, pillar of cancer care. Uh, we all know about surgical uh, cancer care, medical oncology. And image guided oncology is going to be a new pillar of cancer care. That was the finding uh, in 2006 and uh, it goes from the example there that you have to do surgery where the patient has to spend, in this case the context of US is about $35,000 and they have to be on a hospital or out of work for 35 days. And the same patient in 2006, you see that it's $7,000 and the patient walks out on the next day. So the interventional oncology is a new field which is growing very, very rapidly, even in the Western markets at uh, more than double. So that's the space we are in. The company is founded by uh, G Healthcare professionals who have all at least 20 years plus experience in uh, leading businesses in G Healthcare, both in India and outside of India. And we are in a space of uh, planning, uh, execution of the targeting using robotic assistance, and, and post-procedure validation, that's the key from right from targeting and uh, executing to robotic and validation of the procedure. And uh, uh, we are proud to have the offices in uh, Chennai, we are global headquarters is in Chennai, in India. And we also have an office, advanced technology office in Boston and some of our regional offices in Turkey and in uh, Thailand that <coughs> won the Red Herring Award. And in terms of the markets today we are in, we are in almost all the uh, Asian markets today. Uh, we have uh, install base all the distribution channel in all these big. Uh, we soon have signed up the distributor for uh, Latin America. We are shipping the products next year. And uh, I will now give it to uh, Don who will start. Normally, um, a radiologist, an interventional radiologist, takes years to understand how to basically place a very long needle deep inside the body to touch and you know extract a tiny bit of tissue. How do they do this manually? Well, the radiologists tell me through trial and error. A big learning curve. Young radiologists take years and years and years to do this. What they do is they, we've done with our robots, with our targeting and needle guidance, is we've taken that out of the brain and we put that on a two-dimensional computer screen where we can make marks on the computer screen and the robot interprets those marks as three-dimensional movements. That's essentially what we're doing, is we're taking years and years and years of manual dexterity that um, uh, produces some great targeting on a manual basis and we're introducing a robot to do it uh, for the doctor, to support the doctor in the process. So suddenly, uh, young doctors with little experience, older doctors with a lot of experience, have the same immediate you know, uh, capability of being able to position it at, at great levels of precision. Okay? Um, and even surgeons from all over the world that are very interested in this. There is a deep interest and a need, everybody is wide open for this technology solution. And doctors who have limited experience. Here you can see here from the Alfred Hospital, Dr. Thompson, who has just purchased one of our systems that will be going in the next couple of months. Makati Medical Center, the head of uh, radiology, uh, who's also considered one of the top interventional radiologists in all of the Philippines, 
uses our robot for the very... Yeah, just uh, to add to what Don said, in terms of the credibility in the media, these are the top hospitals uh, which have installed uh, both in India and outside. It's fine uh, so far. And uh, as of uh, March 12, we have 20 patents spending. When we spoke two years back, this is the product that we had. You know, when, when we spoke to you all and we raised our series B funding, we had the PETA. This is the product we launched in 2009. And in the, in the span of you know, uh, just less than three years, we have launched two new versions of the product. That is the kind of, uh, and that's certainly something I'm sure any product company will feel uh, very happy about. And one difference, is, as Bala was uh, mentioning in the previous slide, uh, we are not a trading company. It's not that we just take this product from somewhere else in other countries and say, all these products are designed, developed, made here by us in our own uh, team of engineers. And they all qualify various regulatory requirements to be sold in different parts. So EX, as this product is called, you know, it's, it's a high-end version of the Rovio platform. It's called Rovio EX, which has everything that a big interventional radiologist would ask for today, not just in India, any country outside of India. And that's been a big success now as, as we have started talking to the customers uh, um, out, outside of India. And the other version of the product, Romeo platforms, what you see here is easy, very relevant to the Indian market. So we have two versions. This, as you know, they do CT scans, MRI scans, ultrasound scans, but not many of them venture into doing these intervention projects only for big institutions in diagnostic setups also. The Rovio EX, it's, 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 this, is, this is the model which is meant for the big institutions and the entire in international market. It comes with everything that a doctor using a CT scan would like to do today. Any just because that's a growing requirement today. I'm, I'm sure all of us might have heard every alternate person today has a pain, back pain. You know, that which happens because of various reasons. The only way these back pains are treated is by giving some kind of medicines into the space where actually it actually creates the pain. And today it's done, if, if you don't use these robotic solutions for example, these have to be done in an operating theatre. Whereas if you have an equipment like this, these procedures can be done right on the CT, CT scan itself. You can do it there itself. And the, is this that nobody thought about such things? No, it's not like that. In world, I mean, there are companies in the US, there are companies in Europe which have thought about these. So we're on a great track. So look forward to see next time when you come for a meeting. Hope my vision come from reality. Maybe the 18 months or yeah. this or what I told. Come 8 o'clock, leave 12 o'clock. Thanks a lot.